What's going on guys? This is Muzzofuzza. We're doing some more How to Pwn. Going to be talking about the FAMAS today, which is the fourth... Is it the fourth? I think it's the fourth assault rifle that you unlock. Um, going to be using Hardline Pro, Slide of Hand Pro, and Hacker Pro with some RP Jizzle, uh, Tomahawks, Dual Mags, Red Camo, all that good stuff. Uh, the FAMAS is probably the easiest assault rifle to use in this game, at least in my opinion anyways, either the FAMAS or the AUG. Because the FAMAS and the AUG both have the exact same stats, and uh, they almost feel the exact same, they just make kind of a different noise. Uh, but I get an MLG Pro death off the spawn right there, which is always fun. Um, but I really like this gameplay, I'm using kind of a weird killstreak setup, I'm using um, sentry gun, uh, chopper gun or dogs I think, so, and I don't know if my sentry guns do very well, I think they actually get me killed a couple of times, because uh, that's kind of what sentry guns do, and I've since stopped using sentry guns, because uh, every time you use a sentry gun, you're promoting someone to get their ghost pro, uh, which is not good. And I use Ghost. I use Ghost when I'm using a shitty class. Like, I'll never use Ghost with, like, a G11 or Ghost with an AK-74U. But if I'm using something that I think is gimped, like a shotgun or a sniper, I feel like using Ghost is alright. Because that's kind of more useful in that sense. Um, but if I use Ghost on an assault rifle or a SMG, I just feel icky because it just feels too overpowered for me. Um, and if you're using a sentry gun, all they have to do is knife it, and then they can get their Ghost Pro on, and that gives people all the more reason to use Ghost, and all the more reason to shoot down your air support and make it so you can't get gameplays. Uh, so that kind of sucks. I'm, I'm not a big Ghost fan, but I'm not going to be ranting and complaining in this video, because I know a lot of you guys don't want to hear it. You've heard all, every other commentator in the book talk about how much they hate Black Ops, and I don't really have much else to say other than uh, this game is fun when it's fun, and it's not when it's not, so... That's just kind of how it goes for me. It's fun when it's going well for me, and when it's going like shit, uh, this game can really piss me off. Just That's how any Call of Duty is, though. I don't know. Uh, but the weapon stats are on your screen right now for the FAMAS. Um, pretty standard. 35 damage per bullet up close. Uh, 25 from long range, so you're going to be getting 3 bullet kills to 4 bu bullet kills. Um, picking up my puppies here, doing some work. Uh, the dual mags are my favorite attachment on the FAMAS. If you haven't tried out the dual mags, try them out. It gives you extra ammo. Uh, pair it up with Sleight of Hand Pro and you got almost instant reloads and instant zoom in on people. Um, the iron sight on this gun is great, you don't really need a red dot, but if you do use a red dot, uh, that can come in handy too because the red dots on the FAMAS, the FAMAS has so little recoil that it's just so easy to control. Even all the way across map it's easy to kill people. Um, all you gotta do is burst fire them. And uh, this weapon is just simple easy mode. I don't, I don't know what it is about it, it's just probably the most overused weapon I run into. The most weapons that I run into in this game are either the FAMAS or the AK-74U. That's what I see the most of. Um, unless I'm playing with like YouTubers, then it's the sniper. Uh, everybody everybody loves the L96. I don't know why. The sniping in this game uh, induces rage and sadness for me. <laughs> that's, that's all it can really do. Uh, I never really have fun with it. I got kind of gypped there. Uh, I thought I was going to kill that guy easily and then he just hit fired me with a commando. Kinda sucks, but here I'm calling in my sentry gun and it gets me killed from behind somehow. Oh, it was a helicopter. I think the helicopters in this game prioritize whoever's doing really well, just like it in COD 4, like whoever's doing the best, it would prioritize like that person for the kill. Prioritize? Prioritize. Um Yeah. Sentry gun just got me killed like three times there. But I still come out with a pretty good score and I still managed to get a whole nother set of puppies, I think, by the end of this. Uh, even though my chopper gunners don't do very well. If a chopper gunner does well and it doesn't get shot down the whole time, you can, you can get a few like quad kill feeds. Uh, it's just as good as the one in Modern Warfare 2 and you can get like 100 plus kill games. But I find it a lot harder in this game to get like 100 plus kill games because the chopper gunners come down so much faster. Um, people are like more attuned to use Strellas in this game. And uh, my chopper gunners just seem like every time I get one it just comes down almost instantly. Um, so I'm on and off about what I'm using. Let me know in the comments below. Do you guys still use chopper gunners and like have you had any success? Like what kind of game types does they do they actually work in? Because in Ground War, which is what I play the most of, chopper gunners don't really work anymore at all, period. Like I've been trying to use gunship to mix it up, but I love my puppies too much to give up gunship and I've been messing around with like sentry guns a little bit and then I tried out Rolling Thunder last night and I've just been mixing up my kill streaks trying to find out what works best to get good gameplays. Because um, nobody really wants to see chopper gunner gameplay, but a chopper gunner is usually a surefire way to get a lot of kills. And uh, you can't even, I don't know, in this game, you, there's no surefire kill streak that's going to get you a lot of kills. It all depends on how well you do. I think I got a triple spray there. Was that a triple spray? You'll, you guys will have to go back and look. But uh, nice little sentry gun positioning here. Um, got another chopper gunner in my pocket. I think, I don't know if I called my new puppies in already. I'm not sure. I haven't really kept up. 
Um, but I'm going to run upstairs here in this building, which is a nice building to keep safe in. Oh, I'm killing this guy right here. Um, come up here and call in my chopper gunner. And I think the se second chopper gunner does a lot better than my first one, which is always a good thing. I like hiding around these beds. Um, there's a bed on this side of Havana, and there's a bed on the other side. And if you hide by them, uh, they're a good spot to pick people off that are running across the middle of the map. Good spot to like pick people off that are just running out of their spawn. Um, Havana is probably my favorite map as far as spawn trapping goes. Because from either side, if you spawn trap them at A or if you spawn trap them at C, uh, both sides are really good for getting lots of chopper gunner kills, which is like the key to getting a good gameplay is getting lots of, uh, you know, air support kills. That's just kind of how it works. It'd be really hard for me to get a good solid score, like a 40 and 3, with no kill streaks doing any work at all. That's just insane, and I'd have to be playing against, like, complete retards. So as much as people like to hate on air support, uh, it's how I get good gameplays. Like, that's how other people get good gameplays as well. And I've been, I don't know, I'm thinking about um, trying out some, like, Napalm, Rolling Thunder, I don't know, something else. Trying to try some new weird setups and see if I can get some decent scores. Um, so let me know in the comments, would you guys like to see, like, decent scores with weird killstreak setups? Or just really solid scores with the standard setup? Because it's pretty easy to get a good score with, like, Blackbird, Chopper Gunner, Dogs. But I know you guys have seen a million of those, so I'm going to try to mix it up. And uh, I'm going to bring back more weapon clips, too. My shotgun weapon clips are the tits. You guys are going to love them. I get some quad feeds, I hit mark some triple shotties, and I get some I get some cool little shotgun clips. They're all really, really fast plate, fast placed. I think that's the second time I've said that, fast placed. I have trouble saying fast paced, because uh, I talk so fast when I do these commentaries, but whatever. I'm just going to roll with it, because uh, I don't really give a shit. After this, I'm going to hop off and play some Bayonetta and do some more High Roller Live. Um, hoping to bring some more variety. I hope you guys liked my Serious Sam video. Got a lot of views, got a lot of good feedback from that, so I'm going to definitely do another episode of that with Fuzza. Um, that was a lot of fun, and I want to start doing more collaborations with other commentators. So if you have any commentators in mind that you would want to see me do a video with, like uh, in the past, I've done a dual com with who X Jaws, I've done one with Wings of Redemption, I've done lots of different collabs, but I haven't done one in a long time, so I think I've got a... I'm going to do something with Optic Carmi, and then I might uh, try to get some dual comps set up with some other dudes. Some uh, 1600 Microsoft Point box for box dual comps. Pee in the butt nipple shots. Oh, I didn't even know I got another I got another uh, sentry gun here. So I had another streak going. This could have been like a third chopper gunner dog skill streak, but I don't know if I make it all the way. Um, that would be fun to get like a gameplay with three chopper gunners or three gunships or three sets of dogs. I don't think I've done that yet. Uh, I've come pretty close though. Um, but I hope you guys like this episode. It's wrapping up here. I get my final death there. And uh, if you guys like the video, leave a thumbs up because I am collecting those thumbs. And uh, every little thumb up helps my collection. But uh, that's it for today. I hope you guys like the video. Final score was 63-7 and 7 with the FAMAS. And uh, I'll see you guys later.